So just to start out, thanks everybody for coming out tonight. Really appreciate uh, everybody being here. Appreciate the parents putting this on uh, so that we could celebrate Johnny and Alexis. And John and Alexis, I appreciate from the bottom of my heart you guys actually choosing to do it at this time. I know that this wasn't your guys' optimal time that you wanted to have your wedding, but a lot of it was with me in mind, knowing that there was the possibility for me to be in a different assignment and maybe not guaranteed to be here. So you guys put that to the forefront and chose this date, and that means the world to me. So I think most of you guys know, but I'm Walt, um, John's brother and the best man. And um, so over the past few years, I've had the honor to do some really cool stuff, but being asked to be the best man for your brother's wedding is an immense honor that doesn't really compare to anything else. And maybe there's some people in this room that have had that same privilege, but it's, it's incredible. And John, I thank you for choosing me over everybody else that you could have chosen to have the same honor. Alexis and John have been together as part of our lives for the past three years, and it's been amazing to watch you guys grow as a couple. In an age where so many of us find our significant others with a little help from dating networks, um, it's, it's amazing to see some people as a success story the old-fashioned way, even though we know that that wouldn't have happened without a little nudge from the parents and many trips to Antonio's. Because anybody that knows John and Alexis knows that they are very shy, and it probably wouldn't have gone much more than hi. Little, Little, little awkward and, uh, you know, shy greeting and move on and then go back and, you know, to their houses and think, wow, that, that person's pretty cute. It'd be fun to talk to them, but I'm not good at that. So I think our parents definitely had something to do with that. I'm not sure that either of these two really would have found each other if it wasn't for that, but it's no, no surprise that you guys are together. And that's where... I know you guys are meant for each other and the whole magic of Nickel Street in New Haven. <laughs> so that's, that's where my parents met each other, where my parents met Alexis's family, and where we grew up. And there's just so much magic that happens on that street. And that's just tied our families together from the very beginning. This is where I can visibly see the love that has grown between Johnny and Alexis. They truly complement each other in ways that make them a perfect match for each other. It's been amazing to watch you guys grow together and challenge each other to be better every day over the past three years. And Alexis, when I see you out there with Johnny getting dirty in the garden or helping him clean the chicken coop, I am amazed by that because honestly those critters kind of gross me out. But the fact that you do it for Johnny and embrace that and love it is where I know that you guys, that love is real. And it's amazing to see that. But Alexis, you've also grown to be a true part of our family. And I love the bond that has developed between you and Chelsea as well over the past couple months. So that means the world to me because it means that mine and Johnny's bond will always be strong and continue to endure and strengthen as time goes on, knowing that the two of you are going to continue to be part of our lives and not just be people on the outside, but that there's four of us. And that's, that's amazing. So John, I'm proud of the man that you've become and I'm honored to stand with you today. So I'd like for everybody to raise their glasses and join me in a toast to this incredible couple.